Hello everybody. I am uh B gamers with no face backup editor. Oh, no not backup editor. Well I'm their editor, but I'm also a backup gamer. But soon enough that's going to turn into an editor and a gamer. <laughs> So, we are playing the Stanley Parable. Jesus Christ. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Can I go on Stanley here? decided Please? to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No Perhaps matter he had how simply hard Stanley died. looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. I remember that you could... Okay. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference. How Nor dare you did it bully me! The story in any way. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Hmm. Now you see, the door looks appetizing since it's to the left. And left is my favourite direction. But screw you! This was you. not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Ah, admire. Yes, truly a room worth admiring. It had rent but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Good for you. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, mm. really, I'm not. Really? I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. Now you see, I could walk off that story right here. There's someone cool. you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you've forgotten about. Please. What? Really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration yes, for Yes, I others? have zero consideration Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Yes, Why? you do want something bad to happen to you. I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you. To show you something beautiful. Okay, good for you. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. Now listen carefully, this is important. Stanley walked through the red door. <laughs> don't like the color red blues, bro. Aha. Perhaps you misunderstood. No, look, please, but Stanley walked through the red door. I still don't think we're communicating properly. Stan, all right, fine, go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so My badly name's not what's Stanley out there? You want to find out what lies at the Seriously, end of this road you've me chosen? Stanley. Well, don't let me stop you. You see, there's nothing here. I haven't even finished building this section of the map because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. Broken rooms, exposed developer textures. Okay. Is this what you'd want to right, sir. Was it worth ruining the entire story I'd written out specifically for you? Oh, God. Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What would have made this game better? You're not what existing. did you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? Work with me, you've given me absolutely nothing so far. But tell you what, let me take a stab in the dark at a new design and you can give me some feedback. Okay. There we go. A third option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. Nah. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. No, I don't, I don't want to. Okay, I guess okay. I have Okay, I'm going to stop you there. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. A one? I don't like you. I mean, I can understand if you had reservations, you saw ways the game could be improved to more fully express itself mechanically and artistically, but a one? That's not even helpful. What am I supposed to do with that? Uh, but I guess it isn't my place to judge. Here, based on the data from your previous playthrough, I've compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. Let's take a look. Okay. Oh, what is it? No, hold on, I want I wanna listen to this. No, no, not listen to it, I wanna see it. Jesus Christ. Okay. Now 
Would you say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors? Again, honest answers, please. Hey, I nearly forgot I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lovely opportunity to give it some playtesting. You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Yes, I do Let mind. I don't want to. Oh, my God. Of course. Mm, I don't want it. The baby crawls left towards danger. You click the button to move him back to the right. And if he reaches the fire, you fail. It's a very meaningful game. All about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. I think the art world will really take notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. So why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Be sure no, to see. keep notes on your experience. I would, but... Oh man, my hands hurt. Oh no, I can't push the button. Oh wait, yes I can. Oh no, I can't push the button. You heartless. Whoa, you no need for that. No need for that. No need for that. No need because for if that. It's the latter, no I need for that. To do. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience for me. Mm. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. It's over. Thank no, you for that's playing. not. Your input was extremely valuable. That's a bit. Oh, hey, um, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game just to ease the pain? Let's oh, see. God. What do we have? Well, that was a bit uncalled for, narrator. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. This seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. Okay, what game is it, Mr. Narrator? Well, oh, Simon, okay. Is this any better? At last, uh, is this Roblox? Desired, Bro, it's Roblox. I had absolutely nothing to do with. But is it enough? Tell me that, Stan. Will it ever be enough? Well, it was fine, Diamonds. I'm done making things for you. From now on, I will only create to fulfill a greater artistic purpose. Build the Watch house. This, Stanley. I'm going to build a house. <laughs> this will go here. No, here, and then... Let's see, what does it need? I, uh, yes, of course, and just to finish it all off... Yes, it's complete. I made this standing. Look at it. Gaze upon my work of art and feel ashamed at your own inadequacy. Well, I couldn't make anything ah, better than that, to but be you've honest, only seen it from the outside. You've only gotten half the experience. Please, step inside and make yourself comfortable. Isn't it grand? Isn't it perfect? Yes, we it must rebuild this out of... Actually, no. This third small valley. We you must know. rebuild it out of diamond. Okay. Diamond, right, so everything. The game plot yes, for yes, this yes. is get Come one on, ending when span it across. Or I could get two endings. I could probably get both. So. Oh my. It looks like it's going to get a bit dark. Have you brought a light? No. Oh, no, 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 no. This is far more open-ended than I had in mind. I'm looking for something more narrow and linear. Okay. Something that makes you feel utterly irrelevant. This won't do at all. One out of five. Even the diamonds couldn't save this one. Okay, new game. Okay. What now? It's going to be Fortnite? Actually, no, because he wants something uh, linear. Uh, Roblox. Mm. Oh, okay, then. <laughs> yes! I don't even know what this game is, but I love it. You, trapped in a glass box with no way out, listening to me talk. Oh, it's inspired. I couldn't have done it any better myself. What is this game even supposed to be? I can't figure it out. Okay, now I'm curious. Let's go find out what the hell this is. Yes. Ba -da -ba -da. Da, 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 da. Oh, it's a puzzle. Critical thinking, Stanley. You're dirty. Genius. Let's stay open. 
Well, there is free endings. No, I actually, you know what? I think that's plenty. Oh. I really don't care much to see you stop. Oh, damn it. I fell through the map. Okay. So, second ending we're going to get is like the standard ending. All so. of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Oh no, bro. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference. Yes, it did. Nor did it advance the story in any way. The difference it made was you talking again. Which it actually know, because that's a horrible difference. Okay, so I'm just going to have to go sadly we need to I wasn't there before. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, I was doors, not there before. He entered the door and okay. left. It's gonna change now. Oh yeah, there's also like an ending. Yet there was not a single person here either. Are you staying Feeling in Janet's a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, yeah. hoping he might okay. find an answer there. Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned around and got back on track. That's sad. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Do I have to go to my boss's office? What if I want to go to my office? But I can't now, so... Like Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Shocked? Stanley was in such okay, a rush to get right through somehow. the story as quickly as possible, he didn't even have a single minute to just let the narrator talk. That kind of anxiety isn't healthy, so he relaxed for a few moments with some kind of I didn't even know music. that was it. I thought it was 2 weeks, 7 I haven't been in a while. Feeling soothed and rejuvenated, Stanley calmly walked forward into the opened passageway. Okay. What if I don't calmly do it and I just walk through it like this? I know, I don't think that's calmly walking into it, so. Descending deeper into the building, Stanley realized he felt a bit peculiar. It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, to question the nature of his job. It's Why absolutely awesome. Now, when for years it had never occurred to him. Oh, this no, question bro. would not go unanswered for long. Stanley walked straight ahead through yeah, the so large door of the endings. red mind control facility. Now this way, it says this escape, so obviously it's going escape to be escape. On it, the truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. But it the says door escape. behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. Nah. At this says point, escape. Stanley was making a conscious, then, concerted effort to walk an forward escape. and willingly confront his death. But that's how it works. Hmm. Unconventional pit. Seems safe to me. Whee! Although I should be dead by that fall. Motion, and Stanley was inched closer and closer to his demise. He reflected that his life had been of no consequence whatsoever. Stanley can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't know the real story, trapped forever in his narrow vision of what this world is. Perhaps his death was of no great loss, like plugging the eyeballs from a blind man. And so he resigned and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shadow life. Stanley.
Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator, as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body, killing him instantly. Yeah, we can get another ending look right here as well. Stanley Parable. And yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. So this what exactly is did the narrator really think ending. he was going to accomplish? When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Dark. Do you see now? Do you see that Stanley was already so, yeah, dead is... from the moment he hit start? The office fire. Two doors, which is labelled all the way over here. Okay, so like, no, the other part of the game. I think it's in option in options. It's it was somewhere because I remember it. Uh, what was it? Oh, how did I? How do you enter it? Okay, uh, I think you do have to begin the game again since you've already gotten an ending. But. Okay, so we need the console to open. I don't really remember how, but we'll see how when it happens. Okay, right, it seems that I have absolutely zero idea on how to. How wonderful. Stanley was alone. Finally. This is great, he thought to himself. This is what I've wanted all along. I got what I wanted. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Okay, so that there was the Stanley Parable. It's a really fun game. Well, I enjoy it. So I should be back maybe sometime next week for another episode. Um is this is soon going to be like kind of a daily thing possibly so if you want to check out like some more content posted by me I will leave my epic channel link in the description because this is a free man channel um, so from that I will see you all later bye bye